period, and then more than halfway through the third period, you only had one shot on yeah. the ball. Where was the response in the third period? Yeah, there, well, we didn't have any response all game, really, to be honest with you. We were lucky to be down by one goal at that point. Um, so uh, I think uh, Hartsey obviously kept us in it there for, for a large portion of the game. But but still, I mean, I think that was kind of the message in between periods. We recognize that we weren't good, but there's still an opportunity here. And, uh, and clearly, we didn't grab it. So, um, you know, going to have to regroup here. This is obviously uh, a disappointing game. Uh, you can go into the break feeling good about uh, kind of where we were going. And then uh, uh, clearly, that game did not match, you know, our expectations. So now we have to respond to that. Before the All-Star break, you were saying that you felt like some of the habits, you're developing the right one. So I guess where was the disconnect once you got back? That's a good question. Uh, you know, obviously we're gonna we're gonna have to show some video here in the next couple of days. Just as far as there really wasn't one one aspect of our game that was, uh, you know, it's not like one part of our game broke us down tonight. Uh, you know, you can start with uh, one-on-one battles, loose puck races. You can move into execution. You can move into the structure, the detail of our game. I mean, we can uh, pinpoint a lot of things. And it didn't seem like we really had anybody that could, uh, you know, keep swinging the momentum. You know, maybe we would have one good shift, and then we'd follow it up with a bad shift. And so, um, you know, again, we'll we'll get to work here in these next couple of days. And and uh, you know, we've we've started to try to establish what our standards are in certain areas. And uh, tonight we didn't meet those standards. The same things from the power play tonight, or is it? Yeah, is it yeah. I thought I thought the power play match matched our five on five game. Uh, really didn't generate any momentum for us at all tonight. There was a power play situation in the third period where uh, somebody didn't didn't go out on the ice and yeah. it was kind of lengthy. Some of the four guys in the ice. Was yeah. there some kind of miscommunication? That uh, was just somebody not being ready for their guy, you know. And uh, and obviously, like as a coach, you 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 know, you're sitting there, you're watching. We got a two on one in that situation, so I'm watching that play. But uh, the communication was was there on the bench that we had four guys, and it still took another five seconds for for the player to be ready. So yeah, we got to be sharper. To me, it's a prime example of of where our heads were at. You know, assignments that we're, you know that we've drilled over and over again, shown on video over and over again that we were missing right from the start of the game. So, um, you know, I, I think that uh, our next game will tell us if this was just a little bit of sloppiness coming out of the break um, or how much more work we have to do. Last question. Mike, were you surprised there was a lack of focus tonight after a week off? Uh, I don't know. I mean, uh, you look at the last time we, we started to roll going into the Christmas break and then uh, – uh, for whatever reason, you look at how long it took us to get going after that. So, um, again, I think that our, our next our next game will give us some better answers on that. Um, I thought that we had a really good practice yesterday. Uh, I was I was very surprised. Um, you know, you expect a little bit of sloppiness. Uh, you don't expect uh, perfection coming out of a break. Per, you know, primarily in the execution. But I thought that uh, they were certainly more willing to. Um, to engage in the one-on-one battles, block shots, do all the little things that we were doing before the break uh, that we didn't do tonight.